So glad you're kind toward Pokemon. If you weren't, I'd have to... Oh, I just can't say it. What, were you gonna kill me or something? Uh, the music went silent! <laughs> wow, Dawn is a homicidal maniac, apparently. That's not a side of her character I think I've ever seen before. Child than it. It has no purpose for existing. What's the matter, Cricketot? You feeling like the obviously scrapped pre-evolution of Volbeat and Ilumise that you are? Oh! I am so lame. Never doing that again. Wow. First off is this guy. Yes, sir. An old rod is a good thing. Hey, I'm not going to judge you if you're into that. You think so too, am I? Right? Um, buddy, I'm only 10 years old, but okay. Um, yes, good answer. We can be friends. Here you go. That's my old rod. I still can't believe that guy had an item that... Good. It wears off right at the very end. And one step! One step after it wears off! I get jumped on by a Geodude! We can see that he also has one badge as of this point in the adventure. His playtime is a lot shorter than mine. <laughs> and if we go to the back... <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's something I haven't shown off yet. You can sign the back of your trainer card. I like walking two spaces north of the hikers. Watch this. Look at his eyes! It's just like, hey hiker, you got mustard on your shirt. It's like he's reacting to like something bad happening. <laughs> You should talk to the underground man at Eterna City. Been there, done that, don't need to see anything else. Your planet needs you, goodbye. Wow! I was doing a bit more digging and I uncovered what I think is the sky plate. What? Very next dig! I get the poison plate! Are you serious? Hi. Don't forget to close the door when you're decorating. We don't want any visitors getting hurt by walking in on you. Hey, I don't look that bad naked. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that out loud. I am so stupid. I need to think before I speak. <laughs> no, only region we're missing is Hoenn, so I thought this would be a perfect compromise of bull. Let's weaken it. Okay, good. What? What? I didn't even know it had teleport in the... Well, I'll be right back. <laughs> so, we're gonna go through one at a time and see what we got here. <laughs> um, you named it so... Whoa. <laughs> well, the walk back to Selassie on town would be a really long trek, or a really long bike ride in my case, but you know what? I caught myself a Curlia, and I could... I'll step outside and then use it. Okay, now we will use this teleport, and I will show off how awesome my curly- Right, you can't use it in a town, you have to be in a route. Be right back once again. I will show how awesome my Curlia is, damn it! We will go back to Selassie on town in an instant with this thing! Wait, uh <laughs> I healed the Orberg Pokémon. <laughs> Sorry, Curlia. I thought I was gonna be all cool and flaunt you all over the place, but I guess I'll just bike back to Selassie on town in shame. I don't want to look bad again. Not my boyfriend is watching. Um, guys, I got news for you. Um, whoever's idea it was to come here on a date is kind of a deadbeat as it is. Wow! Did not mean to make a pun out of that. Bad taste joke is bad taste. Wow. Can't escape room? Okay, I guess to be fair, we're not really underground so much as we are above it, but I can tie it onto like a tombstone and rappel out the window. Wow, I'm just going all around bad taste here. Um, I'll meet you guys down at the bottom before I dig myself all. I just, what is it with my unintentional puns today? I swear I'm not meaning to be disrespectful. <laughs> it can raise happiness. Um, so we'll leave that. Obtain the determination? <laughs> what? I don't know, maybe I'm just not patient enough, or I just don't have the coordination though, but I've known people that can win so much stuff on this. Oh, what? Shiny Clefairy! What? Just as soon as I say I'm complete ass at this, wow, this game is really out to cheer me up today. Um, only two. Really? Well, that kind of stinks. Oh, a great ball. Okay, uh, let's see if we can match this. No, didn't get anything. Got three replay. Oh, another shiny! Luck be a lady tonight! A week. That's seven days. 
that took of on and off attempts whenever I happen to have the time to do it. And for what? For what? Some text boxes! Cause I'm not gonna use this TM! The things I do to get footage of everything. TM64 explosion! The wordplay on the sign outside finally comes full circle. Please keep playing the slots for another explosion of good luck, she says. That is misleading text if I've ever seen it. I have a story about this TM. Back when Diamond was new, I played these slots for a good couple of weeks, trying to get to 10 bonus rounds. I was the first of my friends to do it. And when I finally got that TM, I had a friend who was a fellow competitive player ask me, hey, would you be willing to trade that to me for something? And I'm like, eh, sure, why not? I can always play the slots again to get another one, considering that she said that. No, one per save file. You can't get another one without restarting. That is bad text. I'm sorry, I've just, I've earned this rant. I've been wanting to tell that story for like eight years now. Uh, these reporters are still blocking Lake Valor and we can't go in at all. Even though that Galactic Goon ran over here, I guess they'll let him through, but not us. Maybe they, he agreed to an interview, so that's why they did it. It's just, these freaking, <sighs> that moment when it hits you that the reason why they haven't been reported is because they are the reporters. <laughs> They don't report this stuff on the news because they own the news. It's all a conspiracy. It's over. I have beaten your challenge. Target number was nine turns. I did it in five. I am perfect because I have the most powerful magic of all on my side. But friendship? No. Not friendship. The ability to manipulate space time. No amount of friendship is going to beat that. Oh, uh, wait. What? Wait, what? 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 count if I beat the target number? Or the target number meant that I had to do it either equal to or less than. Spell tag or shadow tech, shadow, no, shadow tech isn't a bill. never mind. Oh. You, today, I, uh, today I saw, I saw it, today's number is 94, show me a, po show me a Pokemon that is level 94 and you will reward me. You jerk. <laughs> wow, if that's not rotten luck, I don't know what is trying to step very carefully. The worst thing about these areas is when you step on the wrong tile and you have to redo everything you've worked for up to that point. I swear that was not on purpose. Wow. Well, seeing as we are here and Supernova is what? Half a level away from getting that evolution that I really wanted. We may as well see what metronome spamming gets us here. Roar of time, whoa. That is a 150 power special dragon type move! Ooh, I'm that was a critical hit. Fire Blast! Supernova. Can we, can we talk? Like, really, can we talk? Your luck. Like, I thought stars were supposed to be lucky. People wish on them and... Just, why shotting these? It's really only meant for those situations when I just barely don't one-shot something. Sandstorm, pfft. What is it with the AI trainers and not reading that I have Magic Guard? I'm not complaining though, but it just kind of seems like, dude, that is an 85 accurate move and I have missed three times out of four with it. Four, four times out of five. Are you? <sighs> Point is, we have made Barry wait quite a long way out. Red deep. Look at, look at his face, like, his eyes! Barry, I knew you were impatient, but I think we made him wait so long that he lost his soul. Well, um, I, I guess he's waited long enough. He can definitely wait a few more minutes. Uh, yeah. Acrobat can learn that. I'm kind of wondering if maybe I should get rid of Bite in favor of U-Turn. Uh, uh, KID! Isn't it nice? I love my inflatable tube! KID, I am rushing off toward an explosion! I think that's a little bit more important than you and your dupe. Oh, whoa, okay, um, uh, that, after only two columns. Oh, uh, there you are, just north of that shard. Rainy days make me feel blue. The snowy days make you feel white. But the instant it starts to snow, I'm as happy as can be. I guess if you think of what being white is, that kind of counts. Oh, wow. Okay, that was a really dicey joke for my standards. I didn't think of that until after I said it. Wow. 
A rare candy is the only thing that can make me glad that I walked through four spaces of this. Okay, I'm not gonna complain about the snow speed all that much. I feel like I did that enough last time, and I'm kinda sorry if it got to be a bit much, but it really is just that bad. And if there's one other good thing that I can say about that route in the vein of trying to be more positive about it, at least they weren't jerks enough to put a daily event on that route. Be thankful for that much. Hello, hello, would you like to hear a trendy saying? Uh, sure. Very well. Um, incidentally, I had a very refreshing dream last night. Trendy saying for you would be... <laughs> Are you serious? Oh my god! Dude, this guy had to have heard my complaining from like across the tundra. I must have been like complaining so loud I caused an avalanche or something. Oh my god! Oh my! <laughs> Let me talk to you again! I hope you'll use trendy sayings in a trendy way. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Maybe I'm taking that too far. You! Oh my god. I was wondering when she was gonna come up. You! She's like, hi, do you have Medicham? If you do, would you want to trade it for my Haunter? Oh boy. I hate this woman. Okay. Haunter. I hate this Haunter. I don't say that I hate many things in this world, but I hate this Haunter. Okay, first off, yes, Haunter is good. It evolves into Gengar, who has always been a great Pokemon. And it's even better now, thanks to new moves like Focus Blast. Sure. But this. This. I know what you're thinking. Wow, I can trade a Haunter and evolve it into Gengar as soon as I get it without having to do any multiplayer stuff. That's awesome. No. This woman is a troll to the greatest degree of trolls. She tells you that, and then gives the Haunter an Everstone. Plus, Nintendo Wi-Fi connection is gone. It's offline. If you can trade it after equipping this item, by all means, instant Gengar. But otherwise, stay away. This woman is evil. And I think all of us playing through this game for the first time have sour memories of thinking, hey, Metacham is right outside of town. I'll catch that and get an instant Gengar. I don't even have to trade for it. Eh, no, you won't. Hey. In addition, if you're wondering where this teleporter went, it goes to this room. It's how Cyrus got to that speaking room. And um, I guess to spread a little sunshine on the dire situation we have ahead of us and the fight that we have coming up, let's have a little bit of fun. This mic is right here, unattended, so some snot-nosed brat could just walk right up to it and go, Team Galactic Smells! And have it heard all throughout the building. <laughs> Sorry. Always wanted to do that, couldn't resist. It's kind of funny, um, this room, this particular room of Mount Coronet, I have very strange memories with. I have a friend, I was with him when this happened, so I can attest to this being real. He was in this room, didn't have any repels left. He ran into a shiny graveler and it used self-destruct. You can imagine how soul-crushing that was, but that's not the end of the story. His very next encounter was another shiny graveler, and it also used self-destruct on the first turn. <laughs> it is by far the best worst luck I think I have ever seen anyone have in my entire life. You could activate my Marvel scale once again, that might be kind of good. Maybe I should have kept that on, this is really bad. Come on, Vanity, please. Please do this. Come on, Vanity, come on. <sighs> I think I've lost this. I really do. Dude! Vanity! <laughs> okay, I'll admit, not healing when I had... When I had Acrobat on the field was kind of stupid of me. Just for seeing if I couldn't do without healing items. But man, having a narrow win like that, I think was kind of worth it. Oh man, <laughs> I'm shaking a little bit right now. It's been a while. I've tried a few timer balls. I'm down to 20 dusk balls. Let's try it, why not? <laughs> okay, heal ball. Let's see if you'll look fabulous in pink. One, two, Three! Down! What? <gasps> Mesprit, I'm sorry. It's not that I don't like you. I think you are an incredibly charming Pokemon and you've had some sweet moments in the story up to this point. But you just don't stand out that much in battle. 
Thought I had it there for a moment. That is the best I have done so far. Wait. Oh my god. I didn't realize it. Mesprit really is charming! Yes! Oh, Mesprit! I didn't realize you had that in your starting moves that even though you used it before now, I didn't put two and two together. You really are charming! Mesprit, okay, it's official. More than ever before, you need to be made part of my collection of Pokemon. Now that I know that you are playing off of my words to make your own bad puns without being able to speak human language, you are genius. Ding. Ding. Ding, ding. Ding, ding. Ding, 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 Oui, je ne sais pas, je ne parle pas français. I shall give you a Finion, as I have armed myself with the knowledge that you would have this in-game trade for me here today, yeah! I am so sorry to all 12 countries I have just offended in the span of like one minute. I don't know, I feel so dirty using things like PP Max and Ethers and a li- You ass! Okay, you are a brilliant ass. That is what you are. Wow. <laughs> Though I will say, for how powerful he is, he can certainly work on his intimidation tactics a little bit. I don't exactly think Guo Bobobo is the best battle cry or the most intimidating one. Just saying. Also, you see that metal thing on top of its head? It's a toy airplane, and now you can never unsee it. <laughs> All right, all right. And uh, let's go up here. I know that there was an item that, oh gosh, where was it? I think we saw it earlier. The brilliant assery is spreading. <laughs> that is the second time we have seen anything like that. Wow. <laughs> Should I say slam into that rock with how I'm just liking my extreme wording today. I run into a wild Pokemon on the only tile. Are you? Here I'm like, I don't need to use repels because there's no encounters on the ass. And then I forget that this is a DS Pokemon game. I seem to also really like that accent lately, almost like as much as I like the word slam. <laughs> Regigigas is only level one. <laughs> oh, poor Regigigas. <laughs> It was lowered from level 70 in Diamond and Pearl, and I don't know why. Ah, uh, poor, poor Regigigas. They're not referring to Regirock, Regice, and Registeel as they're only speaking of one Pokemon. They say they feared it. And the three Regigolems are nothing but keys to open the th Uh, I thought we'd be here a heck of a lot longer. <laughs> yes, they serve as keys to open Regigigas' tomb in the Sinnoh region. <laughs> I don't know what they were so afraid of with it being a measly level 1, but maybe in an alternate universe where it was level 70, it might have been pretty fearsome. So. What happens when you mess with science and force a legendary Pokemon to breed? Fion happens! With one leg and a third arm growing out of a lump on its head, it is a monstrosity born of the loins of Manaphy! Drama aside, it's not very good. <laughs> Next is the Ribbon Syndicate. I do apologize. Oh, wait. What? Uh, 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 what? 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 I thought I had enough. I'll be right back! Now will you let me in? Why the heck not? Let's go inside. 
I do. Wait, wait. No, I have 10 ribbons. What are you talking? Oh, okay. I thought she was actually going to turn me away because it's been a long time since I've seen this. And that is every single obtainable Pokemon in Pokemon Platinum. And with all of that done, repels the feck war off. <laughs> well, there goes all the drama from this situation. <laughs> all right. With Man, I am just having a really rotten time ending this video. I seriously knocked over my drink and the glass shattered. <laughs> Here's a great story about getting splashed with water. Old man, the end. <laughs> Old man, the <laughs> I didn't know that's where she was gonna go with that. That sounds refreshing, it's made me feel awake. Thank you, please give this to your Pokemon, the alert ribbon.